Hi, Pakira. How are you? Hi, sir. Uh, I'm fine, sir. Uh, how about you? I'm good too. Thank you. So many, many congratulations to you for getting a job in the field of software testing. So how do you feel? Uh, thank you, sir. First of all, uh, I'm feeling very good uh, because uh, uh, this is hard work, uh, around one year of hard work uh, to get this job. Uh, uh, actually, I joined a testing for learning testing course. I joined in the month of June uh, last year. So started to learning. Uh, I, I think I won't get job, but uh, the lucky is uh, I, I prepared much more uh, uh, to learn, uh, to see our uh, uh, interview, interview uh, videos daily where we are up updating the videos so uh, i uh, i also don't have any communication and proper uh, confidence also by seeing your videos and uh, also i'm technically good but the thing is uh, uh, because i came from uh, non technical right so mm. there is no much much communication is also not there so by watching those videos and uh, i learned these things i am feeling very good sir great great so that's a good thing uh, so, Pakira, uh, you were working in non-IT field. So, what was the job that you were doing earlier? Yes, sir. Uh, it's a kind of uh, like quality control. Quality control, sir. There is, there, uh, it's a fabrication company, mm -hmm. uh, like manufacturing. So, in that, uh, they, they, the, their workers are also there. So, I have to verify the what they are manufactured with, uh, with, with, uh, with according to the... Uh, engineering drawings, CAD drawings are there. So whatever they build uh, the uh, products, they build are uh, according to the drawings or not. I have to verify them. So uh, around I have three point six three point six years of experience in quality control. Mm -hmm. So but the reason is uh, uh, I I interested to learn testing. Uh, so that's why I moved my uh, my ch uh, change to uh, mechanical to IT fields. Great. Okay. Uh, was this a virtual interview? Uh, last I attended that, no, sir. Yeah, yeah. In which you have got yes, selected. No, no. Yeah. no, sir. It's a face to face interview only. Mm -hmm. There are totally two, two technical, two rounds are there. One is the uh, exam, like a uh, written test, uh, mm -hmm. and uh, another round is face to face round with uh, manager. Okay. Uh, it's so... a, it's a, it's a round of like uh, HR and uh, uh, manager. Both are taken in the same round only. Okay, so both the rounds were completed in a single day. Not sir. Uh, actually, it's, uh, there is a one week gap. One week. Uh, gap. Have written. Uh, I've written the exam on uh, Thursday. After uh, after Thursday uh, on Friday, I got uh, face to face interview after selecting the exam. Wonderful. Is it possible for you if you can recall those questions and you can uh, help us? Yes, sir. Sure, sir. Yeah. Uh, so let me share my screen. If you can help us with the questions. Yeah. Yes, sir. So two technical uh, rounds. The first Sorry. Yes, sir. Uh, the, uh, yes, sir. Two technical rounds are there. Uh, okay. Uh, first is a Round one is it's an exam like uh, they asked what is the string string buffer uh, difference between string and string buffer. So the role which you have got is of an automation testing. Yes, sir. Uh, they offer me as a automation tester. Great. Now only I got I got mail to from the company you are selected completely. Wonderful. But they they informed they informed me in the company itself. But uh, by officially I got mail today only. Okay, okay, great, great. Uh, then uh, there is a hash map and hash table difference between hash map and hash table difference. And uh, write the test case for a login functionality with non functional and functional test cases. Then, uh, what are the different types of testing? So, you know, they asked me that, sir.
what is the code coverage next question is okay um, and uh, in the typing in the testing also one more question they ask like uh, except uh, from performance and functional what are the different testings you know you have to write the testings then uh, uh, there are multiple choice questions also there but uh, i haven't remembered those questions it's uh, like okay. tricky questions uh, all are related to the technical like uh, automation testing only okay, okay. these are uh, these are all related to manual and automation uh, uh, java hmm. yeah. it's uh, like totally around 40 questions 40 marks i have to qualify around 18 marks yeah okay okay fine the, in the in the second round means mm. uh, automation also sir they ask mostly automation also in the multiple choice questions mm -hmm. right uh tell me about your in the uh, face to face means uh, they ask tell me about yourself Mm -hmm. So this first technical round one was a written test, right? Yes, sir. It, that is a written test. Uh, like it is, a, they have a, one website. Uh, like uh, they conducted exam in the their systems. They have a separate software. Is there? Okay. Then. Then they. Then they asked me what is the difference between. Uh, they asked me firstly, I have mentioned in my resume API testing, sir. Actually, I know the API testing. So what is the uh, what is the what is API testing? They asked the first question. Mm -hmm. So I told that uh, it is uh, like uh, uh, with testing the application without browser or uh, by ch checking the uh, business layer called. We can tell that uh, API testing, right? Mm -hmm. So I told that. So uh, we are doing the backend then, uh, testing in API testing. Yes, sir. Uh, as for the UI UX is layer. not available. Yeah. Right. Yes, sir. Correct. True. Uh, and uh, then one more question. What is the path parameter and query parameter? So I told uh, in the URL after uh, after domain name, whatever is, whatever is there, that is called path parameter. And after question mark, whatever is there, that is called... Uh, query parameter mm. uh, that's I have given answer to you uh, then uh, coming to the manual they ask ma ma from manual manual point on point of view mm. uh, what is the difference between smoke and sanity straightforward questions yes sir uh, there is no any like uh, tricky questions then uh, he asked me difference between uh, test uh, test case and test scenario. Mm -hmm. Then uh, what is the web table? How you will find the web uh, uniquely? What is web table? Whatever. Uh, how you will find a uh, uniquely in the web page? I told that uh, whatever the element is developed with the uh, table tag or tr td tags, uh, those we will call it as a uh, web table. Mm -hmm. There is a one formula like uh, double slash table. Uh, for uh, one table, we have to uniquely find that. Uh, uh, with the attribute or visible text, then uh, T body slash T body, then we have a T uh, TR, mm -hmm. then uh, slash TD that is that I have told to it that uh, so it's he told it's a, that is correct only. Okay, uh, did he ask you to write yeah. create some automation script or develop? Yes, some sir. Uh, it, yeah, uh, uh, like he asked orally, you have to tell how to write the uh, 
test script for login functionality he told that uh, some features are there like username password and login button and also forgotten password link so you have to write the you have to tell uh, how how will you write the test script for uh, login functionality so i told that uh, i have to create a class first then i have to create main method inside that i have to create web driver driver equal to chrome new chrome driver right. then uh, uh, so i have told in orally so he accepted the answer mm -hmm. great uh, then he asked me what is the difference between a regression and a retesting also mm -hmm. um, then uh, he, he asked me i i mentioned in the resume like uh, test ng i know the frameworks very well so i mentioned in the resume so he asked me what is the test ng framework uh, so i explained like uh, there are it's, it's a um, like tdd framework like uh, test driven development so through which we can we can develop the base class for a common functionality mm -hmm. uh, to extend base class and uh, like that i have mentioned and also he asked me tell me briefly about test ng okay about test ng and about tdd bdd uh, those things were asked yes mm -hmm. uh yes sir he asked me that uh, questions but uh, currently i'm learning bdd also for my Great. In the actual uh there uh the, in the project they are using uh, currently bdd only but uh if we want to do bdd means we know the uh, tdd like uh these files web driver utility then base class these things we know right absolutely so if mm. we are mm, if we are perfect in the td means uh, bdd is very easy i'm thinking oh true yes sir so bdd uh, is more of uh, you know where you create feature file you will have step yes, definition sir, file. file yeah step definition yes. yeah and in the feature file you will be mentioning keywords in the plain text english format right yes given is easy to then... understand yeah easy to, yes. for non technical people yes sir but uh, whenever i am learning this tdd i i think that it is a very difficult but after uh, slowly learning it's a comparing to tdd bdd is very very easy i guess easy. yeah yeah uh, then uh, these are the questions. Uh, so HR asked uh, after that HR also uh, asked so some questions. Mm -hmm. uh, tell me about your family. Tell me about your family. Okay. Then uh, uh, I mentioned that my experience like uh, mechanical uh, like mm. uh, non IT experience right. Mm. So why you are uh, why you are the shifting from non IT to IT. So mm. I shocked that time because I didn't know the answer why you are shifting me. So I literally answered like uh, uh, I am interested in quality control also but uh, keen to learn in uh, testing. Uh, so if uh, there is a career growth is there that's why I changed from uh, non IT to IT. Mm -hmm. So he, she accepted my answer. Then uh, mm. she also asked me, there is a four months gap uh, where I joined in the institute. Mm. So he, she asked me why, why there is a gap also. Mm. Okay. So gap related questions so, were asked to you in the HR round. Generic yes, questions. Uh, and, al questions. Mm. Uh, and also she asked, uh, the, you have, I think you got more salary in the previous company, right? but we are not offering that much salary. So, are you comfortable? She asked me. I told uh, I'm uh, comfortable. I, currently, I'm looking for a good opportunity in uh, IT field. Mm. So, she she might be trying to understand whether uh, yes. what is the your point of view, what is going on in yes. your mind right now, yes, more sir. in previous. But, but it was non IT in which you were earning. Yes, sir, that was non IT. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Okay, fine. Then 
she asked me like uh, uh there it's a like one product based company we are offering uh, very less amount are you comfortable also she asked me so i i agreed with salary you no know, i am compromised with the salary no issue i told her that's happening sir and uh, one more thing uh, the uh, i got this job because uh, api testing uh, morely i consider because uh, api testing is uh, because it is a one extra extra like we can say extra future uh, extra skill i have uh, so they may consider this job is uh, so he has uh, at least knowledge in testing okay okay that's why okay pakira so apart from these questions any any other questions that are coming to your mind uh these are only the questions uh, but mm -hmm. the, uh, multiple choice are there but i haven't remembered those questions. no worries that's fine so how did you came to know about this job actually sir uh, it's a uh, uh, in the december uh, my friend got selected in the same company so uh, he is also tester uh, mm. so he referred me in that company uh, okay. so after that uh, so because of him i got the job uh, and also mm -hmm. because he referred more uh, because i am the non it give just just a chance to him uh, he will prove he has uh, everything uh, right. i helped right. him more sir like uh, uh, in the where he, where he was working in the company like uh, tdd mm -hmm. framework Mm -hmm. so i helped him uh, like I, at, at that time only i have learned this tdd framework so he supported me to get a job also uh, and uh, thank you to you also because uh, i daily within 30 minutes only i will uh, maybe maximum i will watch your videos uh, by uploading after uh, 30 minutes within okay. 30 minutes only i will watching the videos and also whenever you are asking some open questions right mm. the those questions also i am answering uh, uh, 100% le trying to learn and after that i will post that uh, comment yeah yeah i have seen seen those things so i see mm. your comments and uh, uh, the folks also who are commenting so that's very good to know right yes sir. and uh, um, what advice would you give to the people in the market who are trying to join as a fresher or who are looking for a switch as an experienced um uh, if we are uh, uh, like if we are looking for it field means mm -hmm. we have to proper communication you have to develop the skills first mm -hmm. then uh, uh, from the testing point of view learn everything from basics uh, if we think uh, i know the concept means uh, we cannot explain in the interview interview mm -hmm. is the as same we have to prepare very well then have, we have to uh, attend the interview i before i attended the more than 15 interviews uh, in the i know the uh, answer exactly but how to express uh, i feel that uh, so we have to prepare and attend the interviews uh, we can easily select in the right interviews right right so uh, yeah i think uh, we are good thank you so much uh, pakira for joining and for sharing your success story right and i'm sure this will definitely boost a lot of uh, confidence in the people out there who are looking for jobs okay okay right, thank you right yeah thank uh, you then i have one question uh, sir yeah. you will be posted this video in the youtube right uh, i'm uh, yeah i'm uh, stopping